Hey, how's it going, Chrome Chris here? Welcome back to Assassin's Creed Odyssey. Now, this is episode 100. I didn't think I was going to make a 100th episode of any of these series. However, you say that. Um, but it turns out we have. <laughs> we have gotten that far. Alright, um, but yeah, we are in Atlantis. Um, we're gonna try and help the Archons of Atlantis. Oh. Alright, I don't wanna throw the road, I just wanna go this way. But yeah, we need to be up here. Somewhere. Or down there. Is Azais a physician and an Archon? Azais saw me yesterday. Told me I'll be able to go home soon. Come on. Okay. What have I missed? What must I do? Azais? You have your hands full. Vikastis, you're a welcome sight. The only one I've had in some time. So Everyone many knows sick. who I am already. I'm surprised anything can spread in a place as advanced as this. Oh, it's shocking. Nothing I have tried will cure the sick or stop the pathogen spreading. I've lost so many already. Okay. When did you first notice people were getting sick? At the start of this cycle. It began quite slowly and I didn't think much of it. But then the cases grew rapidly day by day. The more that fell sick, the faster the pathogen spread. The start of the cycle. You seem wow. really worried. Have you ever seen a sickness like this before? No. There are many odd phenomena during this cycle. Plants dying, strange insects and animal attacks. I worry about what this could signify. Don't worry. We'll find a way to stop the sickness. Tell me what you need. Well... There was a device being worked on by a scientist named Consus. Its intention was to rapidly heal injuries and eradicate disease. Was? His device is missing. Scientists here have tried to replicate it based on the schematics, but it's still in the experimental phase, and it hasn't been tested on humans. Of course. So it may not work. That's not the biggest issue. Poseidon has outlawed the use of our technology on humans. Yes, he I did. I fear that if we don't act quickly, the pathogen will spread across Atlantis. If you think this healing device can help the sick, then I'll make sure that you have it. The wisdom of an issue, but the compassion of a human. You were a good choice for the Gustis. No, oh, thank you. You'll find the device in one of the issue laboratories in the Consus Archive. Consus Archive, okay. Right. Uh, oh, oh. You'll see that we've changed our get up. We are now wearing. Uh, the Persephone's. Well, actually, we're wearing the armor that we're already wearing, but we've just disguised it to look like Persephone's. Just makes us look more like uh, an Athenian. Not Athenian, Atlantean. I will get these terms right. The only thing I want now is a legendary Phobos. The device as Ace wants must be inside. Oh. oh, I can go inside. Ooh. But I'm maybe not supposed to be here. Uh, 
This guy's gonna see me, isn't he? So how do I get in there? What's in that box? Oh, my body's tingling like mad. <laughs> there must be more of these somewhere. Adam and Ingo. Oh. Hi. It was just a statue to start with. Found it. Because I'm a genius. <laughs> Would you notice this movie? Oh, looks like she's gone. I'll take that as you know. Assassination on this guy. Hey. 
Okay, and where's the treasure? Is it up? Somewhere? Because I've got that. I've got the adamant. Oh, how did I miss that? Not what we needed. What's up here? area. And it's only in this room. But we've looked in the box. Does this count as exploration area? Yeah it does. Something. Maybe. Alright, we need to get out of here now. Does anybody come in here? No? Cloth is going to heal the sick. I hope his ace is right. So I wonder if Cassandra scattered a bunch of the issue devices. I wonder if she found them and scattered them. It would make sense to be fair with her hanging around, gives us something to do. I've brought the uh, glowing cloth you've asked for. It's a nanotech matter regenerator, in fact, but you have it. I can't believe it. you do? I thought I had calibrated correctly. Oh no, what have I done? I killed this poor human. The device doesn't work and you stole it against Poseidon's laws. What do we do now? Well, you getting me in trouble, bro. This device is dangerous. Maybe Poseidon outlawed it for a reason. I don't think you should use it on anyone else. I was so hopeful. But you're right. This device isn't ready to be used on live subjects. All I've done is add to the pain and suffering. Some things can't be fixed with devices or intellect. There are problems even the Isu can't solve. I suppose all I can do is return this device to the laboratory and make sure the victims are comfortable until the end. Did somebody see us do that?
That's one Archon helped. Yeah. I hope they're not all this intense. Helped is a stretch. Where is the next one? Just over here. Yeah, let's let's continue helping the Archons. This place is very sick. Where's that gonna take us? Hmm. Yeah, I, there's no point in that, I don't think. So I'll go over here. We'll see where we're going to. This is it. Go over there. Okay, this place doesn't look safe. That must be Amphiris. Why so many guards? Hey, dude. Oh, what's he doing? Let her pass. Whoa. Amphiris, if this is how you treat humans, I can see why you need so many guards. These aren't humans. They are animals. An animal should be in cages. I'm sure everything you do isn't without reason. But if you didn't call them animals, you might get a better reaction. A human did this to me while I slept. When they came to kill me, I survived. But they slaughtered my daughter like an animal. Mm. Humans don't act with logic or reason. Good or bad, they are driven by a will to survive. A trait we implanted to ensure efficiency. But that will become a kindled flame of insurrection. You led a rebellion yourself in Elysium. So I know you understand. If we don't act, the city will burn and many more lives will be lost. I don't see an army marching on Poseidon. This one said they plan to launch an attack. Someone needs to destroy the resistance before that happens. That's not a small request. Despite what you think, all the humans aren't a threat. It is the only path I see. But you are the Dicastis. Only you can choose the correct course of action. Hey. Yes. Killing people will just make the fire spread faster. Now, if we destroy their supplies and their weapons, they can't oppose the issue. I admire your optimism. But I fear it would not be enough. However, it's your decision to make. Just leave it to me. I'll send a message they won't forget. Very well. You'll find the traitorous humans at an abandoned farmstead. Return to me when the situation is resolved. Okay. Five crates. It's not even that far. I mean, why is there issue there? Shouldn't it be humans that I'm killing? I should be extra careful in this area. Ooh. More intelligence. What is that adamant? Oh no, that's the crates that we're destroying. 
One, two, three, four, five. Cool. first because we're thievious like that because thievious is a word oh no please don't alert the others Hard to form a resistance if they have no supplies. Cool. Vicastis, I'm glad to see you return safely. I almost considered sending a regiment of my guard after you. That would have been overkill. You can never be too careful when dealing with violent humans. Come, tell me, has the resistance been quashed? I destroyed their supplies and equipment. You believed you saved lives by being merciful. But the truth is that more will die in the end. I am the Dicastis. I chose the best course of action as I saw it. Forgive my bluntness. I just believe your judgment could have been impaired by the fact you're part human. Oh well. Apology accepted. Okay, I guess we'll go and see what the other guy wants. As soon as we're already doing some of it. We'll go over here. Okay, I thought we might as well get this viewpoint on the way. It's just down there to the left where we need to go. Not too far. Looks like some sort of a hippodrome down the bottom. There. I think it's a hippodrome. I think that's what it's called. Oh, oh, oh. We only do races. Okay, up here. Oh, some sort of a feline in the street. Find an icon. Ah, I can't go that way. Is this the one I'm not supposed to sneak up on? Ah, oh, the Castis! Thank the stars! I was beginning to lose all hope! Atlas said you needed help. 
you don't understand the responsibility on my shoulders. It's my job to concoct entertainment for the masses. But I fear the crowd have grown bored of my grand spectacles. I've seen some good plays. And some bad ones. We need more than a simple play. If the audience leave my shows bored and restless, who knows what they'll start plotting. You think they'll become violent? My purpose is to keep them preoccupied so they can't be violent. Okay. Trying to distract people from their problems will only work for so long. I misspoke. I've seen what these humans are capable of, given the chance. I'm not distracting them, merely keeping them happy. So give the people what they want. What they want, yes. Yes, I can hear the cheers now. The legendary Dicastis Cassandra takes on Atlantis' finest warriors. I knew that was going to happen. You must take part in my next event. Sounds like a Bangration. I can definitely help with that. Huh. Not exactly. But I was inspired by your efforts in Elise. I know you'll do an exemplary job entertaining the crowds as you did then. If we pull this off, we'll be the talk of the city. It's worth a try. Okay. Welcome one, welcome all to yet another miraculous show here in our beloved city. Tonight we have a very special guest. Daldi Castis of Atlantis is here to entertain you. Alright, Cassandra. Entertaining. That's what he said. Do that, sir. What have I just missed? Some explosive arrows, I think. Can I really not craft arrows? Oh, I can. Must have been mid action. Oh, why 
does it keep doing that? Crowd pleaser. Our valiant hero's next challenge fast approaches. A champion bested by none in the city. No mercy, no guilt. Will this be too much for even the Dicasis to overcome? Alright. Now we are going to have to end it up here. Thank you very much for watching. Hope you enjoyed. I'll see you in the next one. Bye.